there everyone and welcome back to my gaming channel. It's been a really long time since I've posted on here. Uh, I was really busy and I didn't have a laptop to record gaming footage on but I'm a little less busy now and I bought a laptop and so this video is kind of a test video uh, to test out my new equipment and to make sure that everything works so hopefully everything goes smoothly. Uh, to test out my gaming equipment, I'm going to be playing my time at Portia. It's a game I've been playing on my Nintendo Switch. It's kind of like a Harvest Moon, Stardew Valley kind of game. And you try to like craft furniture for the villagers and complete different tasks for them. Uh, so this is a game I've been playing in my free time. I don't know if I'll turn this into a series just because I have been playing this in my free time. And I feel like it'd be a hard game to make a series on just because like there's a lot of stuff you need to do and run around and get and stuff and I could see it getting kind of boring. Uh, but I thought I'd try it out for this video and maybe give you a tour of my farm. Right now I'm just waiting for the loading screen. The initial loading screen is really long so I might just skip ahead to when all the loading screen is done. Okay, so it's starting to load in. Uh, so this is my character. It did look more like me before, but I decided to give myself purple hair because I thought it'd be cool. I had brown hair before. And now uh, this is my house. I haven't upgraded it very much. I just have this fan and some uh, kind of junky couches and a bookshelf <laughs> and a table with some food on it. Uh, but nothing super fancy because it, it costs a lot of money to upgrade the house uh, and I haven't really gotten enough materials and such to upgrade it yet. Uh, so this loading screen is also going to last a little while so we'll skip ahead past the loading screen. <laughs> and so now we're outside. It is a cloudy fall day. <laughs> uh, so here we have my farm it is Potato Farm. and. This is kind of the different crafting things I have to make different things like food and cloth. And then this is the crafting area. I did upgrade this recently, so I'm able to make bigger craft projects now. These are different things for cutting wood and like metals and stuff. Oh, I have mail. Uh, well, this is my kind of smelting area. So I have a whole bunch of different furnaces. These ones are the upgraded furnaces, so they cook faster. I think I just recently, oh, and this is the super upgraded furnace I got recently. Oh, is my, are these done? Okay, well, these are some carrot I'm growing. I didn't know they were carrots. Okay, well, these are some carrots I'm growing. Uh, farming isn't a super big part of this game, but you can farm in it. This is my peach tree. I think it's a peach tree. <laughs> this is all my storage boxes. Um, I have a lot of these, so I guess we'll see what's in the mail. I haven't played in a couple of days, so I don't remember what I was doing. I'll have to try to look at my different uh, tasks to see what I was doing. Hey Rebecca, on one of my walks I noticed that you you built for Dawa and the tree farm. I was wondering if you could do something similar for our farm. Stop by sometime and we can chat about it, Emily. Okay, so I guess I have to go talk to her and she'll give me a job. I did a little job, so they gave me a prize for doing it. I didn't do very well, so I didn't get a very big prize. <laughs> um, here I can get resources. I just recently fixed the tree farm, so now they give me wood for free, which is really nice because I was always having to go out and collect wood because you go through a lot of wood in this game. So on the right, it looks like I was trying to make a steel plate welding rod and I have the valves so I just need to make the steel plates. Can I make steel plates right now? I can only make three. So I guess I'll make these three but then I'll need to make more carbon steel to make the last one. Oh wait did I already do that? Yay I already did that! <laughs> so yay now I can make uh, the last one. Can I add one more to this? Okay yay I can. Okay, so once I make the steel plates, I can go fix the I can go fix the poison water. Um, so this is gonna take nine hours. Uh, so the thing takes in game nine hours to make. Uh, so I probably won't be able to fix the water today. So that's kind of a bummer. 
I guess I'll go over to the town hall and see if there's any little jobs I can do. Oh, I made one of these DVD stops and this basically makes it so I can teleport around the map. So I think I will actually go place that because that'll be very handy when I wanna go to the mine. So we will see if there are any good jobs. Oh wait, it's the weekend. They don't have jobs on the weekend. Uh, but I can do this little mini game. I have to try to see what's wrong with these. I'm really bad at it. Okay, so on this one, the light bulb is too big. Uh, what else is wrong? I, I can't tell what else is wrong with it. Hmm. Oh, I think it's this right here. Yay! Okay. So you're basically just trying to tell the difference between them and you're like fixing them. For this one, this part is too long and this part looks a little wonky. And then if I do really good at these, I get materials. <laughs> this one's easy to tell what's wrong. It's this thing and that thing. And then this is the last one. So the handle is bent and... Oh no, that's not... What, what else is wrong? Uh, up here? Oh, it was just a little shorter. <laughs> that would have been so hard to tell. I was just guessing. Okay, so now I'll go place the DDD stop. So we'll head up to the mine and place the DD stop. Have I been saying DDD stop? Have I been saying it three times? <laughs> King DDD. I said DD stop. So now whenever I want to go to the mine, I can just go to a DD stop and I can just teleport up here instead of needing to walk all the way up here. Let's see, I'm going to take a look at my map and see if anyone has any jobs they want to do. Yeah, I need to go talk to Emily. <laughs> so she's at the church right now, so I'll go ahead over there. <laughs> I'm just like walking up to her during church. Hey, so what's the job you have for me? She's like not trying to listen to the sermon at all or anything. <laughs> Hey, did you get my note? Watering the fields can be a real hassle, especially when Granny's back is acting up. Could you help me by creating an easier way to get the water? Uh, sure, I can do that. Great, I was thinking that we needed a well along with a way to pump the water out. That way Granny doesn't have to strain her back so much. You got it. Don't forget, we'll need something to store the water in. I'll see what I can do. I check with the research center on building that well. They're the ones who helped the civil court set up a well by the clinic. Okie dokie. So I have to go talk to the research center. The research center, uh, if I give them like discs that I mine from the mine, they'll give me new uh, equipment to craft. And so I will head down that way. I think it's funny, there's like no fall damage in the game so I can just go jumping around like a crazy person. <laughs> So this is the research center. I hope I have discs with me. I don't know if I put them away. I might have to walk home and go grab them. I should have checked that first. A well and something to pump the water out, huh? Should be relatively easy. Bring me five data discs and I'll get started on the research. I hope I have them with me. Oh no, they're at home. Okay, I'll be back. I gotta go grab the data discs. Okay, I'm back. You have them? Great, I'll take a while to analyze all the data. I'll contact you when we have something. So I'll probably have to wait a few days in the game for her to give me the well diagram, which is kind of a bummer. Uh, so what else do I want to do? Oh, I'll go talk to Arlo. In the game, you can uh, date people and get married and stuff, kind of like in Harvest Moon. I think the person I'm gonna marry is Arlo. I haven't met all of the bachelors yet. I also kind of like Gus. He's kind of mean, but he's kind of good looking, so. <laughs> uh, so I've been making soup for Arlo that he likes. Oh, I only have one left. Okay, well, here we go. And then it gives him like friendship points. And I'll also talk to him because that gives friendship points. I do wish that the characters had more dialogue. They have very limited dialogue in this game. So I guess I will head back home. Oh, maybe my steel plates are done by now. Uh, nope, they still have an hour left. So maybe I'll see you in an hour. 
eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and it's complete. <laughs> okay, so now I have all of the materials to fix it. Uh, I wonder where I need to go to fix it. Um, DDD stop. Oh, here we go. I need to go all the way over here. So I guess we will head out over that way. I don't know if I'll be able to, I don't really know if I have enough time left in the day. It's already, uh, I guess 1900, so like seven o'clock. I might be able to do it. I'll go really fast. Okay, so now I'm at the elevator and this elevator is really close to where I need to be. Okay, I made it to the elevator. And now I need to, I think, head over to that building, maybe? Let's see. So, what do I need to do? <laughs> do I walk into it? Oh, I need to go inside. Huh, I wasn't expecting that. Oh, I see. So this thing is spewing a ton of toxic stuff. Here to fix the pipe? Oh, uh, yep. What are you doing here? I'm investigating. We think someone intentionally broke this pipe. You can see the handprints on the pipe. <laughs> now, who would want to do that? Um, does the mayor have any enemies? Huh, now that'd be interesting. I'm sure the mayor has his share of de detractors out there. Okay, so now I can fix the pipe. Ooh, it could be dangerous to fix the pipe. I, I think I'll be okay. <laughs> Watch my character dies. Something's not right. Oh no, it was dangerous. Wow. <laughs> Sam? Sam? I'm here. Oh no, I fell down in the sewage area. What happened? I don't know. No one's been in this room before. It looks like it's part of the sewage system. I've got a bad feeling about this. If thou dare cometh up me three floors down the rat king oh this sounds like a challenge it's probably the villain let's check it out shouldn't we get some backup no worries you got me okay so i guess we're going to go kill a rat king or something that lives in the sewers i might have to split this up into two episodes because this is getting kind of long oh, oh oh this is an elevator i'm just gonna jump down <laughs> let's see i have my sword but it's already so late in the day. Okay, it stopped time, so I won't pass out from being tired or anything, so that's good. Um, there's some kind of weird thing here. There's a bunch of rats over here. I don't know how to get to them. Can I break these? I don't know what to do. The shark on that thing kind of looks like Daddy Shark. <laughs> Oh, I walk under here. That's all I had to do. Okay, well, that was easy. Now I beat up the rats. The combat in the game is pretty easy. Watch, I'm gonna die. <laughs> uh, but you mostly just kind of press the hit button and try to roll out of the way before they hit you. I'm not sure what that switch did. What's up here? Can I go in this thing? Oh, I climbed this. Okay, I'm just gonna ignore you. Ignoring all the bad guys, because it takes me forever to fight all these bad guys. So I'm just running past them. And I'm singing for some reason. Man, this place is huge. Most of the dungeons I've been in haven't been like that big. Oh, gotta do some parkour. Ugh. I'm just trying to find the Rat King. Oh, Rat King. Where are you? Oh, I think I found him. Yay. <laughs> Art thou the one that ended my son? Uh, did I? I don't know. It talks? <laughs> How rude. Cray havoc and let slip the rats of war. Well, what? I can fight. Why'd you push me out of the way? I have fought many, many rat people. See, you need my help now. Don't worry about me. Keep your wits. 
I'm trying to, but you pushed me over. <laughs> okay. So, I guess I gotta take out these little rat. The red rat. The red rats are annoying. They keep throwing stuff at me. <laughs> okay, so I took down his minions. So I should be able to fight the king now. Oh, villain, villain, this is the last day. Well, you polluted our water supply, so I mean, that's pretty villainous of you. <laughs> oh no, he just killed me. Oh man. Can I just keep fighting him? Okay, I don't think I have to start all over. <laughs> He just like totally knocked me out in one hit. I'll have to try to be careful and try to dodge more. E. I only have 25 health left, so if he hits me at all, no. I think I only have. Do, do I have a limited amount of, of attempts, or can I just can can I just keep killing him? Does it not matter how many times he kills me? <laughs> okay, I'm getting really really close. And. Da, da, da. Okay, I did it. Yay. Curse you. See, I beat the Rat King all by myself. <laughs> Not bad, you did well. Well, I guess I'll end the video here. Not much else will happen, probably. I'll probably just go home and go to sleep. I hope you enjoyed this video. For the next one, I want to play Mario Maker and maybe play some levels created by my subscribers. Uh, so be on the lookout for that. I'll make a community post about it either on my main channel or on this channel. Uh, so yeah, thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you all next time. Bye!